Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Arms Race of the Cold War Era. We are taking it to the USSR. I think we're doing pretty good. This is this is the best I've ever done in this game. So I'm glad to be doing it on the recording. Um, but yeah, it uh, financially we're, we're doing really, really well. Um, Tech-wise, we're a little behind some areas, but although we're heading ground, which is awesome. Space Race, we're way ahead, which is really good. And of course, influence and other things. So, we're, we're overall, I think we're winning, but uh, it's not not quite finished yet. So, I've seen how quickly things can change when your finances just get out of whack. So, hopefully, we can keep an eye on our finances and do well. Oh, it's because we flipped the uh, new government; uh, they can't add any more troops. So, we should be able to take South Korea very easily. I don't even, shouldn't even have to worry about that one too much at all. Uh, there's a nuclear test for us. Let's see, where does that put us? Gets us caught up. I think he must have hit the bottom, and that's why he, I think all his stuff must have gotten reset or something. Because he, uh, it's right here. Let's see if we can see. Um, uh, money. See, it says 2346, but maybe sometime during this year he hit rock bottom. And, um, or something. Maybe he never did. Maybe he still just had to start dropping some, uh, Expenses and that, that's also what kind of helped us help us get a cut up or whatever. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, what is this? Mexico. Oh, hello. Um, yeah. I guess he's going to get Mexico most likely. Since he can add troops and I cannot. Now, I could add some spies here. You know what? Why not? Let's have some fun. Let's see if we can get the opposition back in our favor. Looks like they got a, a summary. Um, could I intervene in Mexico? No. Great speech. I'm just doing this because it's. Why not? It's something fun. Don't really need to be doing that, obviously, but. I got a lot of spies, so we might as well. Come on. A couple more riots. To be able to throw some troops in it. Oh, we have money. Silly me. Oh, we're actually losing some money again. Oh, we'll just keep investing then. Just keep on investing. Come on, riots. A couple more. Yeah, Kill the last unit. I can still support the riots and just flip it over. I don't know if I really need to, but it would be fun to just have all of this be blue. Eh, we already lost the troops. I spent a lot of spies there, but it's honestly not that big a deal. All right, what can we do next? Anything that we do have influence in that we want to take? Did we actually get South Korea? Yes, we did. New Zealand. Um, actually, the opposition here in New Zealand is not that high. Well, we can add it up to 80 over here, but let's just go get enough troops there just to kind of cover it. We'll let the opposition kind of build its way up on its own, I suppose, for now. Australia... Australia's actually close. Australia's actually really close. Let's see if we can trigger Australia up. Discredit Soviet... Yeah, sure, we'll discredit here. That will use some of his influence, why not? Rocket launch. Right, just need to support one more right, and then we can take Australia. Money. Oh, we're still losing money. We just keep doing three percent growth. I'm not going to take anything away yet because I think we're still okay. But uh, yeah, for now we're okay. Come on. Come on, right. 
Give them Australia four points for that one. That one's pretty big. India would be a nice next one to go for at some point. Um, so we caught up there. We're still pretty far behind there. We're heading there. We're maybe catching there. Space race, though. We're doing really good. I'm actually about to get the last ground facility. I actually don't know what that means. I don't know what happens after that. These are coming along quite nicely, although we are on the space shuttle one, which is going to take a little bit longer. Way ahead of him. I don't think he's even... He must have had to drop all of his space points. Given up completely. Uh, actually, starting to get some of these starting to trigger now, finally. Oh, that's just because we're in 1990. I don't think any of these actually ever triggered. I wonder if there's a bug or something, because it didn't seem like anything happened with these. But these are finally starting to trigger. This one's painful. Crisis of the Elites. Yeah, let's not have a Crisis of the Elites. Isn't that what the same thing that this thing's called? Yeah. I don't want a Crisis of the Elites. Crisis of the Elites event in USA? What? What triggers that? He's going to get... What? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. Um... Yeah, let's maybe we should just go after USSR now while we have some uh, some advantage. I was trying to just get our way through the space victory before I did anything because I wanted to get you know credit for that. But wow, oh he actually is starting to get some space stuff going again. That crisis of the elites will be incredibly painful. I mean, there's not much we can do about it, though. So, just hold on tight, I guess. All right, New Zealand. I guess I should just, yeah, keep doing this. Just flip this one pretty quickly here now that we've got this. Got plenty of spies. Yeah, uh, Russian strikes are starting to... Gain some ground again on the overall firepower, I think. Yeah, he's caught up with me there. Got tons of troops, though, that I can use for places. Come on. Yeah, if he triggers that tri crisis of the least, that will that will hurt a lot. All right, start making money again. Not a whole lot, some. About to get there. I wonder what happens to the, the money when we do hit this last one. I wonder if we just get it all back, or if I have to slowly like take it away myself. Yeah, he's he's absolutely positively going to trigger both of these. So I'm going to lose fifteen hundred from my budget and get crisis of the least. So that'll put me at 3,300, and, oh, goodness, that is painful. And I honestly don't know if there's anything we can do to stop that. I wish I knew what trigger these. Um, okay, well then, in that case, let's at least put 2% there. I don't know if there's anything else I can do anywhere else that would really make much difference right now. I'm going to put another point in uh, nukes. Why not? Let's have some fun. We're going to get Crisis of Elites anyway, so it really doesn't matter how careful I am with my budget, apparently. So yeah, why am I doing the GMP thing then, now that I think about it? I should have taken advantage of a few more months of just max whatever. Probably do this two more times and then let it trickle over the rest of the way itself. It won't take like a year and eight months, I think. Come on. Anywhere else close? Not really. Oh, there's the uh, reorganization of the market. Oh, that one only took 20. That hurts. He gets five. Look at this. This just flips everything to his side. Wow.
I might as well do one more to just get this locked in so I don't have to think about it anymore. Alright, keep doing the great UN speeches, I guess. Goodness. All right, this is New Zealand. We're at 60 on the score, which is nice. Um, yeah. Wow. Like I said, we're going to get Crisis of Fleets anyway, so I don't know why I'm worrying about the GNP right now. We're going to have it six months. So I guess six months of whatever we can put our money into. Uh, six months of this make any difference? It might. Let's put as much of that into there as we can. It's gonna get us close. It's not gonna get there, but it's gonna get close. Wish the crisis elites would trigger like right as we're getting to three more points, but that's all right. That's such a powerful thing. We're almost to the end of the game, though. Um, I don't know if we're gonna get to finish the space victory without, you know, at this point then. Okay, so we do... What's the next thing we go for, then? Oh, do we go for that? Oh, there is still that. Okay. I did not see that over there. Ah, oh, well, we're about to get the crisis, so it's not going to matter. I have to build all the way back up for the space stuff. Well, most of this other stuff I don't have to worry about. So we can just worry about the space stuff. Okay, there's crisis of the elites right there. Yeah, zeros across the board. Wow, that is painful. Does that reset this stuff? Actually, it does not reset this stuff. Or is that just a history? That may just be all that is. 28.64.19. Like, literally everything wiped out. That's <laughs> insane. Um, well, we got a lot of stuff still, though. So anything we can do here? Sweden still needs opposition. Yeah, we're still, we're kind of, yeah, not much we can do with anybody else. Hungary, we can give you a get you over 51, why not? Get Algeria over 51. Well, I guess we're going to focus on space victory at this point, because I'd like to at least put some points in something. Local government. No, we don't need to support the government. Of course, we also need to help our GNP again from scratch. All right. Oh no, no, we don't, because we're, we're we're making we're we're pretty high on the money. We're not spending any money, so that's right. So I could probably avoid GNP growth entirely for a bit. Goodness, that is so painful. Uh, yeah, let's just, I guess, put three points in ground facilities for right now. Start trickling that back in. I don't know if there's enough time to left to do anything. I want the space stuff now that we got that crisis, unfortunately. I don't think there is actually not. I'm not doing the math in my head. I mean, these will come through, but just no, there's no way. Not with all this. That's unfortunate. That crisis threw us off. I should have done a lot more investment on space then. Less on the other stuff. Well, now I know the pacing. I hadn't never gotten this far. So I didn't know how good the pacing would be or what the pacing would feel like. These others he's about to get? No.
I guess we're still getting a little bit of stuff there. I guess we're getting four of those. Two, yeah, so we're getting a little bit. Um, so. I guess we'll keep putting stuff in here. I'd like to at least get maybe this one. I'm trying to think of math if we even have time for that. We have what? Um, counting this year, we have seven years. So, what, 84? 84 ticks. So, 84 times 3 would not be enough. 84 times, what, 5 would be just enough. So, we need at least to get 5 here. Because that will get us at 420, which would be just enough. Barely. Um, that means we can put a tick in here, then. Hmm. I don't know. I guess we're still making money, technically. Any more people we can influence? Oh, Seems like military after. This journey is close-ish. We'll probably trigger a war with East Germany. Who knows, maybe there's an achievement for uniting both sides. We could also just go to war with Russia itself, but I was really want to see if I can get through at least some of the space stuff. Although it does not appear that I will get through all of it. I don't know why I just did 81. That was silly. Got tons of troops. Come on. More and we're good. And then maybe we'll go after Russia just because we can. All right, more money. Still making money. All right. Um, so again, check my math real quick. We have 12 times six. No. No, it'd be all of 95, 96, 97, 98, 99. We would not get 2000 itself. So never mind, we have five. So five years times 12 is 60. This is only gonna get us to 300, so never mind. So we need six, we get us to 360. So six would be what we need. It's a good thing I checked my math. And we'll just put a couple points there, maybe. I think we'll at least get this one. But uh, that's about it. Oh, we can do another one of these. Uh, local government support in Italy. Nah, we don't need support. Nothing. Keep coming over after Germany. Support that. Oh, really? I'm gonna have to add another influence. Tons of troops. I guess I'll do that at least. I have more, more, one more influence in to the new government. That means he can't add more troops, which is fine. I'm going to start adding some guys here. Why not? Yeah, should be good there. We're at what? 60, 40. Yeah, we're good. I'll just add some troops here and see if we can have some fun with the USSR. Germany go. Start supporting riots here. <laughs> Why not? Alright, more money. Still making stupid amounts of money, which is hilarious. 
it's gonna get us put us to like eight thousand before the end of the game or something crazy. Not, not quite that much, but it is actually getting us a lot of money. So, uh, four years left, and times six, two forty. No, oh, sorry, four years times doing the wrong thing. Four years times twelve is four eighty. Sorry, forty-eight. Kind of don't do math out loud. Forty-eight. Yeah, no, we're good. Um, launches is also going to be pretty good. Just to yeah, guarantee it, though, I am going to go ahead and put that and just put a couple points there. Just to make sure my math isn't just really done. Right, we got Germany. All right, anywhere else we got some good influence? Sweden. Don't get the opposition up. It's worth three. Oh, we're a little bit light in spies, but. Why not? Let's have some fun. I can still do the rights here, I'll be alright. See, I need to do at least three more? No, four more rights, right? No, three more. Three more rights. Oh, wow, I can't do math. <laughs> I need 35 more, which is seven more rights. So I actually need another another spy. So we'll hold off on Sweden for now. We're going to hit to 80, but we're going to hold off on rights or anything like that. Should get another spy here at the end of the year, which is fine. Space transportation system. So we did just launch the space shuttle, which is awesome. We did take another lead in the nuke side of things, but we're doing pretty good. Overall global influence is insane. 30 more firepower right now. May have to trigger in some more spies or something just to get that to trick, trick, uh, trickle over. All right. Um... So, here, should still be good there. Obviously, we're still getting money. But yeah, we'll go ahead and get a spy ticking in. And then we will, I guess, put the other points here, see how far we can go. Are starting to catch up a little bit on the space stuff, but not too much. Now, now we gotta wait for spies to trickle in. We got another one here in a couple months. Probably not gonna be enough time. I'm actually a little over on time, but we're getting so close to the end of the game. I think we're just gonna run this out to the rest of the game, maybe. This might be a little bit longer episode, but that's alright. We'll finish it off. Oh, hello. We'll go ahead and do another speech. Because why not? You know, some more months, we're going to do another riot. There's USS USA, another rocket launch. More global influence. This next rocket launch will go pretty quick. Should still get the ground facility. Oh, there's another more money. Um, doing okay on the budget. I mean, it's gonna take around the other side pretty soon so we have two more years right with 24 so uh, what is it I can't do math in my head uh, 168 I think one I th no I did that's not bad that's not right yeah that's right 168 um, so because it was 25 would be 175 so yeah, yeah, we're good. We're good on ground facilities. 
then in that case we can put, put one more point in the spies just to get that coming in a little quicker and we'll put the rest in the launches. I don't, I don't, there's no way we're going to get that finished, unfortunately. And we're right. We got this. Well, at least we can kick it off, that is. And we have the spy for it. Any of these things triggering? Ah, well, technically the final shot. The final shoot, whatever. Plus three score for USSR, minus 300. USSR budget. Boosting ages coming up. He's about to get Desert Storm, really. Wow. Alright, here we go. Riot. Troops. Pour in. Just watch the space thing and then troops. I don't think there's anywhere else that we can influence, right? Let's just double check real quick. Just so I don't miss anything. Sweden, we could, but not high enough on the opposition and I'm not spending highs on that. Libya we could if we got the diplos up high enough so eh, you know let's just watch for USSR. Let's just run this game out. We've only got a year and a half left. Let's just sit here and watch it. Have fun. Watch the space victory. Get that last ground station which is actually NASA. I don't think there's any way we win this in a year, but, you know, we'll have some fun with it. Alright, uh, so this will take over in a few months, so let's just put all our points in here. Why not? Let's see how far we can go with that. So close, so close. Definitely have to pace a little bit better next time. Oh, wait a minute. So, oh, does it just continually? Oh, well, that makes sense that that would be just kind of a continual thing. Okay. Well, then I guess I didn't really need to put money to that. I thought that was something else we could trigger. Good to know. Again, <laughs> I hadn't gotten this far, so now I know. Um, had we put all of our ni like $19 now at this point, we might, I don't know if we could have gotten this, but it would have been close. Had I known that. I think it'll end with a score victory here, though, in six months. Did get that. A little less money for him. Opposition in China and North Korea. Does that help us at all? Actually, it does. Do that. Do the government. We got some troops here as well. And then Korea. Uh, does not. You get the influence, but we wouldn't have the opposition. That's fine. I have the influence just to say. No battles here in Russia. Got China, though. How much is China worth? Four. Wow. Two more months, I'm guessing. Unless it does through the 2000 year, which if it does, so be it. You gonna take over? Uh oh, did it freeze up on me? Uh, I don't know what happened. Did we win? <laughs> I don't know. I won. Yes, score victory. Ah, I would have loved to have triggered the space race though. As close as we were, but now I know. Like I said. Do space race a little bit earlier, um, and that crisis, if I had the crisis hadn't come along, I, I think we would have had it in the bag for sure, but that was crazy. I don't know what happened with the 90 to, or the 80 to 90 stuff. I didn't see any of those trigger over, but I'm going to have to look up, see if there's any, any evidence of what actually causes those to trigger, but 
hopefully you enjoyed this. Uh, I actually had some fun. Uh, it's, it's, you know, for, for an indie game with just three developers, I actually think this is a pretty solid game. Um, a lot of fun. Uh, it's, I've had to try so many times. I think I've got probably 20 hours in this game now to, to try and beat it for the first time on easy mode. So yeah, that hopefully tells you a lot um, about kind of the overall difficulty of this game. But I was really all about the money initially, at least initially. So it's gonna be cool to see the next DLC as well. I don't know if I'll play another uh, sh uh, Let's Play of this. I may wait till that next DLC comes out. Or I may just, you know, if I have some time or just want to do it, I may may try a Russia side or something like that. Who knows? Um, does that open up medium for me though? No, it does not open medium for me, unfortunately. Because I think I have to... I think I have to do one of these things to be able to open up medium or something like that. To achieve the mission you do, develop all space technology to finish the game as a winner. So, we'll try again maybe sometime and, and try and get the, the game as the, as the space victory. But, yeah, thank you for watching. Uh, please let me know if you like this series. And if you want to see more of these, then please give me some likes and, and comment below. And then I'll, maybe I'll do some more of these or some other indie games that you have suggestions. Again, thank you and goodbye.